Okay, so today I'm going to talk about a must have accessory in your audio video kit. And no, I'm not talking about this XLR cable uh, from Rode. Actually, this cable right here came with the Rode NT1 fifth generation microphone, which I uh, showed and displayed in a, um, a previous video. I'm not talking about that. I'm actually talking about this right here. This right here is the Hosa Technology CBT uh, 500 cable uh, tester. And the reason why I say this is a must uh, accessory for your kit, uh, first of all, I mean, it has a lot of, um, a lot of connections of different cables that you can test. Uh, we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, um, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13. So between 12 and 13, cause I'm not sure about the USB, uh, how they actually work, but regardless of that, um, so for that, that's number one. Uh, number two is a must have because you never know, uh, when you come across a, a damaged cable, um, you, when, when you're using it, you don't know exactly what the problem is, uh, maybe on site or whatever. But if you have something like this, you'll be able to detect what the problem is. So, um, in today's video, I'm just going to show you, uh, how this works, but I'm only going to show you how it works with the XLR cable. Okay. So here we have this XLR cable. Um, this is, this is the male side and this is the female side. And if you notice, or maybe you should already know, a XLR cable, well, at least the three pin XLR cable only has, as I said, three pins, one, two, three. So what we're going to do is we're going to, we're going to hook the uh, male side to this end. Okay. And then we're going to hook the female side to this end. And then we're going to be able to tell with, with these uh, light indicators right here if they actually work or don't work. And what you'll see, you'll see um, yellow and green light up. That means for one, you'll see yellow is for this side, green is for that side. So if they both light up on one, two, three pin, that means everything is okay. If they don't light up, um, then that means that that particular pin is damaged. So let's give it a try. All right, so let's give it a try. And we have the male XLR on that side. And we have the female XLR on this side. Okay, so right now uh, we have a nine volt battery uh, to power up this, this uh, equipment right here. And, and we can check to see if the, the battery actually is, is working. All we have to do, it says battery check right here. We just put it on here and it lights up green to let us know that the battery is actually working. So let's go to pin one. Okay, as you see, pin one is good. You have both the yellow and the green lighting up. Yellow is, uh, excuse me, green is for this side, yellow is for that side. All right, so let's go to pin two. Pin two also is working. It has yellow and green. And now let's go pin three and pin three is also working with the yellow and green. Um, so there we go. This is the Hosa Technology uh, CBT 500 cable tester. Hopefully this was informative and until next time, take care.